Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's look at the problem seventeen in chapter eleven. Chapter eleven is about the angular momentum. We can see for the hurricanes, we can consider it as the cylinder of air, right? So for cylinder of air and the leader velocity at the end is given v, we convert the unit to meter per second. And also the density for the air is given for the cylinders h is given r is given. Now we need to find the energy. So for the rotating cylinder, the energy must be one half i omega square, right? So now first thing we look at the quantity i. I is the momentum of inertia for this cylinder of air. So it's one half m r squared, and the mass for this cylinder is density times volumes. Now we we consider there the mass is a density times volumes, and input known quantities we get the answer there, and then the momentum ratio for this cylinder inputs m and times r, so we get the function for the momentum of a ratio there, and also look at the omega. Omega is angular velocity is the leader velocity divided by r, right? Now we input the i and omega in this function. We can simplify it, get the function look like that. Input the known quantities, get final answer zero. The second one we need to find is the angular momentum. So for angular momentum is i times omega, and this is a two function. We can see i and omega we can derive at zero, and input is i and omega we get a function for L angular momentum and input is the non-quantity. Final answer is zero. Thank you.